next part leads me nicely on to what footballers do over the summer. Uh, it's, it can be a lonely time uh, at Tull Homes because you're used to being in that uh, that football bubble and training every day and getting told what to do and then all of a sudden you, you, you sort of, right, see you in seven weeks time or whatever, you, you kind of wake up thinking, well, what am I going to do today? You know, I, I don't know what to do. You know, you, you, you can get bored very quickly. A lot of boys obviously go straight away off on holiday. The initial week or so is nice to just let the body re recover and and all them aches and bumps and bruises sort of go away. And then after a week, you start feeling really good again. And you're like, well, I kind of... You know, me personally, I feel I'm ready to go again, but you know you need the rest and the body does need the rest. Basically, what we've sort of said is you have the two weeks where you limit what you do. You know, you literally try and do as little as possible just to let your whole body and everything settle down. But then sort of we've got about a sort of, I think it's a five, maybe six week plan that, that Ian Hutton's wrote for, for us. Um, and we start getting back into it. It just just ticking over to start with, but then as as the, as the summer progresses, it's more intense, and you're getting sort of sometimes two sessions a day in before we come back pre season. Um, I've I've been through what was that thirteen pre seasons I think or something like that. And uh, when I first started, it was a case of. <laughs> You'd finish, and then you boots and trainers and everything sort of went into the back of the cupboard. And then, when pr the day before pre season, you drag it all out and off you go again. Things are different now. It used to be a case of first day where you'd go for a you'd go for a jog for half an hour, and then you'd stop. And then the next day you'd go for a jog for sort of an hour, and and then you know you build your way up. But now, when you first start, first day pre season is the uh, intense it's the first day. So if you come back now without doing anything before. You, you're opening yourself up for so many injuries, uh, you're going to be right at the back, uh, you're going to just look, you know, you're going you're to be embarrassed a little bit. So it's important to, to keep on top of your fitness and uh, you, especially your injury prevention stuff in the gym. Um, so Hutz has wrote up a really, really good program. I've, I've read through it all and it's it's very good program. and. I'm sure it'll uh, if all the boys do it, something they better do it. Um, then I'm sure come pre season, come the first day pre season, we won't have to build up into it. We can start really, really uh, quite intense, and and so therefore we're we're going to be ahead of the game come uh, the sixth of August, the first game. So it's um, so that's the fitness side of things that we have to keep on top of. Uh, the other side is obviously. Uh, Going on holidays, it's nice. You have ten months of the season where, you know, it's it, it's the best job in the world. But you can't exactly, you know, the missus says, "Oh, defence are doing something this weekend." You <laughs> you can't exactly ring the gaffer and go, "Oh, gaffer, yeah, I'm not going to come Saturday. Yeah, the missus wants to go to London shopping or something like." That. You know, you, there's from when you start pre-season to when the season ends, you are, your, whatever the manager the the club need you to do you've got to do you know and every Saturday's taken up um, and even I mean we had a Saturday off this season and we're still in training you know so you literally don't get a weekend to yourself so you kind of need to make the most of the weeks off every every player I've met is different some like to go and sit on a beach do nothing for two weeks just relax and some I've met go on safaris um, some do little you know, breaks in in European cities. Um, you know, I've heard of all sorts of, of different holidays. Some go on hiking treks and things like that. Um, a couple I know have gone on cycling tours. You know, it's, which something interests me. Um, but there's there's all sorts of different things that, that people get up to, and uh, it's important for them to get you know as many as as much time with family, friends, as possible, because once the season starts, you are kind of restricted on what you can do. And also mentally, to probably switch off from football for a bit. It's amazing how focused and, and how, how involved you are mentally with, with the season. I remember, I remember a couple of years ago, uh, because I, 
I have mental preparation leading up to every single game. And it starts sort of on a Wednesday, Thursday, and builds up and gets more intense as, as the week goes on. And, and then on, on the match day. And I remember the season finished on a, on a Saturday. And we, were, we had a lot of Tuesday, Saturday, Tuesday games. And I remember thinking on the Sunday, right, I need to start getting my head around, uh, you know, getting prepared again, start thinking. And, I just, and then I was like, oh, no, I, I don't have a game Tuesday. Oh, no, I'm not training Monday. And all of a sudden, like a wave of relief just come over. And I was like, like, I'd relaxed. And all of a sudden, like, my shoulders dropped. And I was like, you know, that intenseness had sort of just dropped. And, you know, it, it's, it's amazing, you know, how much... You, you like say that the mentality side of it, it is you know it, it's not I wouldn't say sh stressful you know you have stressful moments but it's just such an intense environment that you have to keep mentally focused so, for such a long period of time that having that extended that six to to eight weeks however long it, it may be um, in the off season to have that to unwind and like I say and just literally forget about football just for a little bit is is so relieving and yeah it 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 is nice to just switch off for for a few weeks definitely <laughs>